Good morning. I'm currently at Whitstable Station. It is 12.46 and I've got a 12.49 train to London St Pancras. Today will be my first time on HS1. I've been on the train before, but I've never done a journey, a full journey, so this will be quite interesting. Going all the way from Whitstable, which is in the far, far deep, dark ends of Kent, all the way to London St Pancras. I think it's about an hour and 19 minutes. Let's see how it is. squish to them yeah Enough of a view. Let's start to talk about my experience on this high speed one train. So, for my around 10 to 15 minutes of being on this service, I have to say I'm quite, quite pleased. It's um, a comfortable ride, the seats adequate. Um, I, uh, the interior, interesting. I, it's, it has like a, like a dark color, but it kind of works at the same time. It gives me a very domestic, like, regional train less than a high-speed service but I guess it is regional than intercity because there's no first-class section on this train so yeah but other than that it's great um, these come down I wish these were padded the armrests arm rest were padded with um, some sort of carpet or better material than just plastic because it hurts a bit not as comfortable um, but yeah all working toilets aboard this service available in carriages A and F, G and L. That's the very front carriage of the train, very rearmost carriage of the train, and the two carriages in the middle. For Priory via Canterbury East. As this is a high speed train, it can reach speeds up to 140 miles per hour, but not on this set of track. It does that when it joins the Eurostar, so when it uses the overhead wires instead of third rail, because third rail is capped to about 100 miles per hour, but overhead wires, even faster. We just pulled into Rochester. That's the American. This is a southeastern service. 
service to St. Pancras International. We will be calling at Gravesend, Hipsfleet International, Stratford International, and St. Pancras International. reach Ebb's fleet. Eurostar down there. The 140 miles per hour starts now. It's going so fast. So it actually reached 141 miles per hour. I mean, someone's getting in trouble. And as always, if you notice anything unusual or suspicious, please contact us. We have reached London. Thank you. 